and welcome. All these science fears are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping, because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of finesse. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by... I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. See, I'll need one up there. the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. So basically, the deep underground, the underground aperture science is run by a man called Dave Johnson and his assistant Caroline, who has a very shocking secret. Dum dum dum! I'm not going to tell you what it is though. <laughs> now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Okay, and as you can see, there's water there which will wash up any gel. That's why you got to turn off the water supply so you can... I'm telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. just there is if you give a cube blue paint it will bounce along like mad that's why you gotta wash it down with water but however there's an achievement there's, an, there's another achievement going on here so and what that achievement implies is that what the achievement is if you catch that blue if you catch that blue box like at bouncing off the, the glass if you capture it beforehand if you capture it before it lands on the ground, you get another achievement. And I think I did it as well. So. Science isn't about why, it's about why not. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you 
on the bottom of the way out because you are fired. Now you test subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you. Box your stuff. Out the front door. Parking lot. Car. Goodbye. Congratulations. The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. We're not going to release this stuff into the wild until it's good and damn ready, so as long as you keep yourself in a top physical form, there will always be a limo waiting for you. Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. She is a Goodbye, Carolyn. <laughs> Just got to flick these switches now. Oh, and here's where we can get one more achievement as well. And I'll show you how to get friend, these achievements. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. I don't know why I did that. I have absolutely no idea why I wanted to do that. Okay, can we take two that? Okay, I'm going to show you how to do a team friend, I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. Black Mesa... Oh, here we go. Bankrupt. Sir, the testing. If you're allergic to peanuts, you might want to tell... The average human male is about 60% water. But basically, but if I'm you press these buttons here... On these kind of like doors, so you get an achievement yours, for that. And, and also, if you go here and right stare at this know. like life ring, there's another achievement. So you get two achievements there. And now we've got, and now we've got to confront. So next time we'll confront our greatest rival once more. <laughs>